Today is the hottest day of the year. However, despite the heat, students are preparing for their fall season of sports and activities. Our 13 News reporter Andy Bernhardt is live in Cole Grove, Ohio, with what they are doing to beat the heat. Andy. It is a hot one out here today, and the temperatures are just continuing to rise. But the heat won't stop these dedicated students from, pre from preparing for their fall seasons. The Buckeye State is feeling the heat, but students at Dawson Bryant High School are finding ways to safely continue their outdoor activities. We are taking taking extra water breaks. Um, we've we've been going some with uh, you know a lot of our conditioning stuff. We'll take our, our helmets off, sometimes take the shoulder pads off uh, to accommodate the, the heat. Thursday is the hottest day of the year, and when it comes to training, the heat changes everything. Uh, it takes everybody's energy away. Uh, so, you know, what we've got to do is, is we've got to make sure that they're used to that going into uh, the season. They get used to hydrating themselves and taking care of their bodies, and uh, that way they can perform at the, high, the highest level possible. It's a little harder. Um, it's just harder to concentrate. You're so worried about how hot it is outside, you can't really think that much. Uh, practicing in the heat now definitely makes it a lot easier come game time. However, some students see the heat as a motivator and the sweat as proof of their hard work. It makes me more determined to do it. You just got to drink water and you got to stay focused on what you're doing here and so that you can, you know, accomplish what you want to accomplish when the season starts. Students and instructors say the key to beat the heat is to hydrate, hydrate, hydrate. Drink a lot of water and Gatorade and stuff like that before and after practice. We take lots of breaks. We keep water and Gatorade on hand and uh, keep them, try to keep them hydrated. We have a rule that you know, when we take a break, take two drinks of something at least. And, and then be ready to sit down in the shade for a few minutes and cool off. The heat advisory across the tri-state area is in effect now until 8 tonight, so make sure you enjoy some air conditioning and a cold beverage and maybe avoid wearing black like me. In Cole Grove, Andy Bernhardt, 13 News, working for you. Andy, thank you. Great tips there. And